Next on an all-new Shed Wars, could this be the end for the Grentas? I'm coming in too hot. I can't get the airplane slowed down. And the beginning of something big for fish. This guy will drive 2,000 miles to come get this bone. Shed Wars, all-new episode next on Sportsman. Yep, the bone world is good. Some hunt for money. There's 15. Some for art. And others out of pure oh. obsession. Yeah. But these five teams all have one thing in common. They'll do whatever it takes to rake in the racks before shed season comes to a close. The thing's a freak. But there's only room enough for like two. Yeah. And you better run, run, run. When the bones cry out so In Bozeman, Montana, Fish Fisher starts his week by preparing for what he hopes to be a lucrative sale. Everybody wants this antler. Fish purchased several loads of antlers over the past week and cherry picked the best craft pieces for himself. This guy's a serious guy that will drive, you know, 2,000 miles to come get this bone. Now he's hoping to sell the rest as poundage and still make a profit. Hello. To save time, Fish has chosen to meet his buyer at a way station Hello? where the total weight can be easily verified. I think we have the wrong number. Hello? Company name, private dude? Private dude. Come on in. We got you. Thanks, brother. Yep. The bone world is good. As long as he doesn't pull any shenanigans, we'll have no problem here. <laughs> Actually, I had 35.38 off by two pounds for me. With his stash weighing in at nearly 4,000 pounds, Fish stands to make a healthy profit. What'd you get? 52, 215? Thanks, brother. The bone world is awesome, man. But there's only room enough for like two. <laughs> With the shed season nearing its end, the most important week of all may be the next, as the teams hope to cash in. Let's play.